Hi folks, I'm up here at the Oregon Mountains and we found us a trail that we've never been on before and we're going to go check it out. So enjoy the video and I hope this trail leads to someplace exciting. see a sign off there in the distance. I don't know what it says, but it could say no trespassing. But let's go check it out. That's where we're heading right now. Here's some neat plants over here. Looks like maybe an alo plant. Can't be sure. Closer. What does it say? No vehicles, bikes, or generators allowed on east side of two track wilderness boundary. Hmm. Now I wonder what's the more interesting path to take. I see something over here. Look at the firewood. They left the firewood here. Somebody brought a bunch of firewood in and left it. You can take that firewood home if you like. <laughs> yeah. Well, I don't have a trunk. And I don't have a way, I mean, to, to actually cut it up. I don't know if it'll fit in the trunk. I got a trunk, but I don't know. It's tempting. This big one here. You think I should? I'm just saying. Hmm. I think this will fit. Can you try? Well, we'll take a few home then. This one over here. Oh, that's heavy. Well, that means it'll burn a long time. The smaller ones there. Yeah. Burning up for sure. Take the thing over there. This one's gonna run with you. But besides, it's trashy back there. It's an arroyo. People trash that over there. Too, over at the bottom. Do you think that other path actually takes you down? No, it looks like yeah, maybe. Let's go this way. All right. This looks more like a road than it does a trail.
We've never been down this before, have we? Yeah, this is a, a trail, I think. Let's go down this way. Good exercise. It looks like there's something here. I'm fine. Yeah. Just over there, I had to put my jacket on. Yeah, someone's had a campfire here. That's an arroyo down there for sure. I'm going to check this place out over here. Hey, Lynn, this is the decent path. Is it? Yeah. Okay. Watch my step going down through here. Let's see where it goes. It yeah, it looks like it. Fell. Hmm. Interesting. It's an arroyo. An arroyo? Yeah. It's worth it. Oh, here's some pretty flowers. Let's go look at those. Little bitty yellow blooms. It's kind of overcast today. We had a cold front move in and it cooled things down. <clears throat> and it left us with humidity. It's about 50% humidity. Acacia chip. Acacia. An acacia? Mm -hmm. That's what that plant was? Yeah, acacia. Acacia. A C A C I A. Let's go up that arroyo a little bit. Look at that little, look at that little cliff there. You see it? Yeah. You Small. Little. All right.
Look how sandy this soil is. I'm going to strap my, uh, my hat on the back of my uh, bag, okay? Yeah. Sandy loose soil. Huh? It's pretty flat rock right here. You gotta strap your backpack on. So what you gotta do? Here's some neat little flowers. Little purple ones. Nah. You don't need to know the name to appreciate the beauty. But they're pretty. Look how delicate the leaves are on this plant. Delicate leaves with big thorns. You know, apple has been fast. Go up here. Just take a look. Well, if they were predicting rain today, which they're not, I wouldn't be down here because this thing certainly looks like it could be a part of a flash flood. That's interesting. Look how the roots have gone into this rock. It's like a rock. Layers and layers of desert sediment over the years. Now here's one. Big old root. Looks like it's moved through concrete from an old plant. There's another one. Look at this. You know what we need to do? Need to create some sort of a landmark for the trail we came down so we know where to cut off this arroyo. You know what I'm saying? To go back up. We go put it three rocks. Where did we come up? Well, that's what I was thinking. Where did we come up? That way we'll know. Here. Okay. You can do three left right here. Okay. Yeah. And besides, I got it on video. I can always watch the video again and go, hey, this is where we came up. All right, sounds good to me. Yeah. Let's move up the arroyo, see what's okay. going on.
sage or something else. Yeah, that's what you were always saying. These are like the desert sage, but they're, they're These not. are no different because the de desert sage is a little, well, it could be the desert sage. It's a greener, it seems. Desert sage is upright, I'm pretty sure of it. Oh, upright now. Smell that leaf. It's amazing how deep the roots go. You know, some of these the desert sage. Smell. Can you smell it? Smell. It's, it's sagey. Yeah. It is. It is the desert sage. That is the desert sage. Greener here for the water. Hmm. Smells. It smells like the sage. plants these are, but it's seeding. It's those ones, ones with the delicate, look at the leftover delicate bloom. Oh yeah, this is that purple one I was looking yeah. at earlier, but this one's like already gone to seed. Yeah. Maybe I should use this one to close it up for you. Okay, sure. Hey look, a bird's nest up there. Ooh. See that? Up there, if I were you. Look. Oh, I can't climb up there. I'm not that agile. That's where it is. Here's a big boulder over here. <clears throat> On the side. Maybe a little critter lives underneath there. Can't say for sure. But it looks like a good place. Yeah. This arroyo is getting deeper and deeper as we go up, huh? Berries. Orange berries. Yeah. We'll find out. I can't remember the name of it. Sun's coming through orange today. Yeah. Pretty good. Yeah. That's the name of that. Skunk brush berries? Yeah, or the skunk brush. It's going to sour the edible of me. Make a lemonade out of that. Some kind of a lemonade. Now look at this side. You said, say, take water. Look, look, look. Yeah. Isn't that beautiful? Look, yellow. Very yellow. We need to see this when there's water flowing through it. Ooh. As long as I'm not in it. You don't want to be in it. Yeah. <coughs> Excuse me. <clears throat> There's the organs up there. Desert 
Uh, you said that's a desert willow over there, didn't you? The one yeah, with the... the desert willow. Yeah. Yeah, it's still blooming. So. So somebody's been in here walking once. Yeah. I say that lot. You can tell. They mark their trails. Yeah. We know that, so we can mark that trail. We can take that trail mark. Smart enough, yeah. Well, when we get to this, their trail mark, we're close, huh? Yeah. Let's go back here. That's what those three trail marks are. You know, you know where you learn this trail marks in? Yeah, YouTube. No. No? No, it's Boy Scout and Girl Scout. Oh, uh, they didn't teach me this. I didn't get a Boy Scout. I went to the Cub Scouts. Did they have something like that for you? Not that I recall. See, pass that in the end of the There's some more skunk brush. Yeah. That's a good idea, though, because the landscape begins to look so much the same. Yeah. That's the desert for you. You can follow the river bed. Looks like, I don't know if there's a trail in there. It might be. I'll go up and take a look real quick. Yeah, okay, go ahead. I'll go back here and see if Nah, it's no trail. No trail? Nah, it's just a short little path of something. That's the skunk brush here. More brush. Some white flowers over there. I don't know what kind. Flowers. <clears throat> We're doing all this during the COVID pandemic. Yeah. We're trying trying to stay away from people. Photo shot, that is. Yeah, you're right. I take a photo. Boy, that's a big boulder. Went to go up there and let me film you. Oh, that's fine. Yes, I walk over there to the other side. The mountain should be great. So, do I get my picture taken here? Yes. <laughs> okay. There you go. Got me, huh? Got your photo. <laughs> Look at that sun. Man, it's orange. Yep, that is an orange sun, isn't it? This has been one heck of a year. It is. Forest fires way out of control. China released the virus on us. Oh. U.S. economy's all been shut down. Uh, no one's been celebrating any holidays this year. Everybody's staying away from everybody. For good reason. Yeah, for good reason. That's a nice little hat you got there. Yeah. Haven't seen any snakes, which is a good. There's another bird's nest.
Right up in there. Oh. Yeah, it's an old bird's nest though. Yeah, it's an old one. It's a bad mm. one. And here's the desert willow. Well, this one's a little bit closer to us. This is, yeah. More yellow desert sage. Yeah. Break it. Yeah, this pretty yellow flower. Wow, here's a, a neat stone right here. It's kind of a wash area where the water's gone underneath. And then on top of this stone is a pooling area for the rain. Now here's a plant right smack in the middle of the arroyo. Trying to think of the best way around. Look at these plants. It's almost as though the arroyo provides the best path because you're not going to walk through this scrub right here. There's just no way. So if you're interested in walking through the desert, an arroyo is not a bad choice. for this rock here. <clears throat> yep. Listening for rattlesnakes. There we go. Takes kind of a steep drop in through here. Yeah. Look at the sun. Yeah, I noticed that. Very orange. We have forest fires burning here in New Mexico too, in Arizona, California. We're just under one big smoke cloud right now. Oh, almost forgot. Today's 9 11, 2020. So, this is when the Taliban, yeah, we all know what happened on 9 11.
Actually, it's uh, okay to flew two airplanes into the Twin Towers on 9-11. We went to war with Afghanistan and Iraq shortly thereafter. Took them out of service real quick. Yeah. All right. My wife's calling me. Wants to show me something cool. It's a neat uh, washed out boulder, huh? Well, I don't know if you should see something in here. It's dead already. I saw it in the ground. I picked it up so you could see it. Oh, yuck. It's a pretty wasp, man. Did you, uh, did you take a shot of it? Yeah, but I just want you to see it. Uh, I'm not into bugs. I see I it know, enough. But it's a big one. Yeah. You'd never believe it if I said, hey, you know, I saw a two inch wasp. I believe you. And the wash. In this wash, I'd believe you. Guarantee it. Over there. Two inches. Am I in your way? No. Should we head back? You want to? Yeah, let's head back. You haven't seen what's up ahead. I have. Let's take a look up here. It gets better. It's smoother going up ahead. Looks like some kind of tree up ahead. But pretty much more of the same. Yeah. Well, there's a desert sage there in the front. You want to take a close up on it? Sure, let's do it. I thought that was a desert willow. It is. This one. There's some sages around too. Boy, it opened up real nice here. You can see the mountains. Desert Willow. Let me see. 
Did you, did you get to see the sun? Um, I don't think I've ever seen the sun that orange out here. At least orange. not out here. It's very orange. I'm smelling something. It smells almost sour. Not sure what it is. Hey, I'm going to go up to that mesquite tree. Okay. This almost looks like a trail marker over here. But this looks like maybe the best way to get up. <clears throat> I saw that. This looks like a mesquite tree, but I'm not real sure. And this over here looks like another trail up and out of the arroyo. Well, you can see the orange sun from here, man. Yeah. You know, this just keeps going up and up and up. 
I bet it'll take you over to the mountain's edge. I can see like Weva from here. It's right but in there. But anyhow, here's that tree I was talking about. I don't really know what kind of plant this is, but I do know that there's a bird's nest up there. You can see it. I'd say these stones were placed here by somebody, wouldn't you? I definitely think so. It doesn't look natural. Yeah, I think they put that in there some marker. Yeah, because there's a trail over there that goes up. Probably to a different area. It's a marker for that. It's like being for the marker grass. Would you like some water? I brought some water. Oh, I'd love to. Waterfall, Brought water for me, huh? Yeah, sure did. Are you happy we had the water? I wasn't expecting it. I got a snack. You want some? No, nah, I'm good. I did leave home full, but being out here in the desert, you know, the water is essential. You will dry up. Got water? Just head back. Sounds good to me. It's been a fun adventure. Yeah. I enjoyed it. I enjoyed my little outing. I like to get out, especially during this COVID you know what pandemic. This is? This is your, your arroyo, your walkabout. Yeah, well, that's a new thing that we can do okay. from now on. Okay. If we run out of trails, just find an arroyo. There's a lot of them. This one. This one. At least we don't have to worry about running into other people and catching that. that sun. I got the sun. Yeah, I did too. It's really orange. I don't know if the camera got it good because it's it's very small, but I got it. This one here, though, you can use some of mine. Oh, I'd love to. Yeah. You can use some of too. You know why it's so orange? It's the fires and the fires. Hold on. The clouds are causing the haze, which is good. The problem. I think we are too. <sighs> Real easy to twist your ankle on this stuff, isn't it? Yeah. Let's take a look here. It looks like a moon because of a sun, you know that? Yes, it does.
Never captured them, the sun before. Not like you that. Capture it in there. It's just the base. I wonder what the, the sunset's going to look like. I mean, that's really, that looks unearthly to me. You know, it's really, the haze. The haze. really weird, man. Like a moon. Well, See? Ooh, watch for that. Slippery, yeah. Well, we got this. Look at this. Look, look, look at how awesome that is. Yeah. Look how awesome that sun. He looks like a moon hanging in there, orange like a marmalade. I can't say it's man-made because it isn't. It's just from all the forest fires. Yeah, it's still in the some, cover. Yeah. It's still in the cover. Amazing. Did you see the purple flowers there? Yes, I did. It's nice, huh? Yeah, I didn't see that. Let me see if I can take some photos of it. Just saw it today. What is that? Some kind of sumac plant? I don't know. Pretty neat views today. I say we got some pretty good views today in this arroyo area. See if you can use any of these photos too, because I All have right. some sharp ones. I took both videos and photos. I thought you were going to make the movie this time. Movie? Yeah, the video. Oh, no. You're asking me if I can use your clips. You can use mine. No. Why don't you make it? No, you're going to make it. I get to make it. Okay, I'm the movie maker right here. You wanted something to make. Yeah. You said that. This is the hard part here. Look at it. Should I let you go first, or should I go first, you think? No, go ahead. You can go that way, too. I'm going to pick the easiest route. This is not a good way, because it's a big drop-off, and you've got a thorn bush there. Oh, man. This is some rough going here. At least I haven't run into any rattlesnakes. That's good. Excuse me. Yep, gotta watch where you're stepping.
This is a big boulder. I wonder how it got carried down the mountain. That's the one weird thing. I don't see how the arroyo could carry a stone this big. I don't think it's scary. It just wore down to the arroyo water. Get over this boulder patch here. Okay. Let's give that a good shot. Yeah. Well, if I was a spring chicken, I could get around better, but I'm not. By the way, I'm filming this with a Swift Cam uh, G3S, 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 and uh, Activion CX Gold Plus, and it's shooting at 30 frames per second at super fine definition. The gimbal cost me $30 and the camera cost me $25 and I bought it in 2019. So it was old when I bought it. I didn't buy it used though, but it was old. Hey, you passed your spot. <clears throat> you passed your spot. I did? I think you did. I did. Huh? Did you, did you see my marker? I think I see it, yeah. That's good that you saw it. I guess I passed it and didn't see my own. Marker. You'd know it if you saw it. I think it's your marker. It's someone's marker. That's my marker. This your marker? Yes, so. Sir. That's the way up, huh? I'm glad you saw it. Okay. This way? Yeah, we'd be all over the place. Well, we, we would have seen the marker later on. That's why you're here, just for the two of us. That's right. Yeah. Okay, this is kind of steep, so careful. Okay? I know. It's easier going up than it is down. You can press up a little bit here before you scale the last. The last end. So on the flat side here.
Well, I hear a car up there. Must have gotten through the rut, rutty yeah. blue. There's vehicles that can, but mine can't. It's okay, it's still rutty. It wouldn't matter how good your truck is, Chip. That road must have got a rut there. Next time, we got our mark. Yeah. Is it light? Yeah. Well, the sun's getting really faint right now. Hmm? It's kind of going behind a cloud, the sun. There's that car over there. Oh, I see. I see another truck over there. There's two trucks. They must be having a little party up there. They're together a lot. Yeah. Boy, that's a big barrel cactus. It's a big one. Let me go and take a shot of it real quick. Someone's been over there. Cows, maybe. It's pretty big for a barrel cactus. Stands about, oh, almost three feet tall. It's pretty close. Starting to flower. That's neat. Flowers in it? Yeah, but they're not in full bloom yet. These probably bloomed already. They're seeding already. Yeah, I think you're right. Okay, God, I got it. You can take any of these photos and clips. And we'll get out in I think we went, yeah, that way. Yeah, the car's over there. Is that our car? Yeah, I see the car, yeah. But the way we came in, I'm not sure. No matter, thanks for the road. Let's just start, though. Yeah. Let's give them some space, lots of space.
That was cow tra tracks back here. Brand new trucks, bringing them up here. I think I'd bring up an old truck if I was going to beat it up like this. I just want to take any of my vehicles up the road. Yeah. Brutal on your chassis and also okay. for your tires. Yeah. I agree. Yeah, and I got outside, got some fresh air. Well, I hope you enjoyed the video. We uh, we enjoyed our walk down the Arroyo, or I should say up and down the Arroyo. It was fun. We didn't meet any other people while we were up there, so we're doing our part and in, in, uh, kind of self-quarantine, self-isolation during this COVID pandemic. And... Uh, we had a good time, it's good exercise, chance to get out of the house and away from the whole humdrum of, of being secluded in the house. So we had a lot of fun. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching.